can't hear you. I'm heading into a tunnel. No, I'm just kidding. Just some uh, cell phone humor, just to lighten the mood, you know? Oh, Purple Den. Oh, man, you, you, you know, you actually have a lot in common with these guys. You know, aside from all the hair, you know, you're both being sold as drugs to, for aliens to get a high off of, you know? You guys are, uh, it's, it's like you're almost related in a way, you know, if you think about it. No, we're not shooting one. I'm putting my foot down. Whew, jeez. I didn't want to embarrass them back there, but that tunnel reeks of Fergal shit. Idea. Tr try long. Oh, look at him go. Okay, shit. That village is swarming with cartel guys. How, how do you want to deal with this? You can't keep the moplets living in this crappy village. Their lives must suck. Yeah, well, we did enslave them. But of course, their lives. Too easy. 
Okay, geez. All right, more combat. All right, let's let's see what we got. Rescue some guys? Hey, listen, guys, we, we got you. You're free now. Go be free. You know, do, do we get, like, a, a reward? Uh, we don't have much. Maybe you should hit up our leader? Wow, wow. You guys are so strong. Oh, thank you. You know, it, it... Hey, come on. I wasn't done yet. Come on. Looks like it's locked. You know, maybe someone around here knows the way in. Welcome, welcome. We are Moplets. Hello there, savior. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Krubis. Why were you guys all imprisoned? The G3 are a cruel bunch. They did tests on us to see if we could trigger psychedelic reactions like a drug. But when we proved useless in that regard, they put us to work mining Fergals instead. Man, good God, you know, you, you, you just can't win. You're either a drug or you're a slave, I guess. Yes, and those poor Fergals, so helpless. They're making us destroy their lives, their habitats. It's so gruesome. Basically, our lives are super fucked. It's, uh, it's not good. But you freed us. Everything changes now. 
Krubus. You know, we're actually looking for him to kill. What's this? You aim to take down Krubus of the G3? You are truly a hero to moplets everywhere. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, where is he? We'll, we'll get rid of him for you. Hmm. That's difficult to answer. His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different mines across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, what about the man in the mansion? Ah, of course, a brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubus and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device, that could be very useful. Okay, sure, a guy in a mansion, that, 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 that's the plan? Yes, he would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, savior. What's the guy in the mansion like? Oh, his name is Ranchi Delarmo. He warped in not too long ago. Seems to be old acquaintances with Krubus. We haven't dealt with him much, but he seems to have a penchant for Fergals. Oh, God, he's a drug addict. Nonetheless, we may be able to use that to our advantage. He does have close ties with Krubis, after all, and he seems a bit disoriented. Right, because of the drugs. A and he's evil still, right? Well, yes, he's evil, so it should be morally just. Yes, let's all just agree right now that it's morally just to manipulate him. I love it when we can agree. Hey, thanks for your help. Very well. Godspeed, saviors. So get the fuck out of this shit! Somebody warped in over here. I bet we can cross now. You're the one who fucked up the coordinates. How are we gonna get this thing out of the river? I fucked them up. I just typed in what you told me to type in. Yeah, you typed it in wrong, dickhead. Now we're flooding. Oh, sure. It's always my fault. Hey, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you.
G3. No, I'm not G3. I quit. I was a designer. I was just flying around here trying to make you friends. Oh, that's cool. But, you know, listen, we're busy. Oh, don't worry. I won't be too much of a bother. Whoa, look at you go. You're really flying. You're trying to copy me. <laughs> I bet you want to be just like me because I'm so cool. Well, oh, oh. I'm the only me! Don't try to be me! Hey, fuck you! It's nice out today, I'd say, you know. Sometimes there's storms, it just destroys everything, and I have to rebuild my shack, and... Oh, it's a nightmare. Whoa! Nice try, but I'm too bad for you! Oh, so, so to continue... Did you know that I, I used to work? Actually, I used to work for the G3! Did you believe that? Yeah, and I, I deserve it. I, I, there's a, there's a death warrant out for my arrest, and I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it. And I'm right here with the decision I made today. I've started to take care of the little burgles around my, my side. Fed them and clothe them. Healed them when they make mistakes. And you know my mother. Oh, oh. She, she always said, oh, you'll join J3 one day. You're not good, Quentin. She always would say that about me. You're not good. That's if my three hearts couldn't have goodness in them. I don't even want to get started on her. You have no idea what it's like to have a mother who doesn't support your dreams. All I ever want to do. Uh oh, baby, that shoe baby keeps missing their shoes. <laughs> I'm sure you'll get it! Shit, this guy won't stop! What was I saying again? All I ever wanted to be was a jungle seamstress. I wanted to grab the purple 18! Now that was impressive! You're a real pro! Who taught you how to shoot because I want to shake their head? I want to kiss him on that big, fat lips! I want to fall in love and marry them and yes! to grab the purple trees and create amazing clothing for the commoners. Here it's Zephyr. But no, no one believes in me. No one gave me the Clorglox to save up. So I joined.